Hey guys, I just imported this mesh into my project and now when I hit play, there's a problem with my collisions. Namely, I can walk around the object, but I cannot go through because my collisions are set to the default settings and I want to enter my gate. Now, how do I do make this collision fit to my mesh or make simplified collisions for it? So let's open up the collision. And when I go to here, the easiest thing to do is in your collision, in the details right here, to collision, and then look at the collision complexity and set it to use complex collision as simple. Now when I hit save, you can see the collision is fit around the mesh object. And this will work. And this is the lazy and the easy way to do it. And this is fine for one object, but what happens now is that every vertice here inside of my mesh will have this collision applied. Now do this for many items inside your game and you will have some performance issues. So this is the quick and dirty way to do it. But how do you do this the, yeah, let's say the more performance optimal way. First we're going to remove the collision of this object. We are going to make collisions of our own. Namely we can add a box simplified collision. And like in any object, we can edit this collision around. So when I hit this, I can scale, rotate and move it just like any other object. So let's first scale this one down and move it up. Now, because it's a tutorial, I want to do it pretty fast, so it won't be really perfect. You can enable or disable snapping right here and move it back up can go around and really make it fit to your object. And now what you can do is hold the ALT key on your keyboard and drag it down to make a separate one. Scale that object as well. I mean that collision as well. Move it in place. And you should really take your time to get this perfect. I'm just doing it the quick way. And then also alt drag it out. So this is some easy collisions going here. You can also make this more nice as you go. And now when I hit the play button, I get the same effect, but now it's less performance heavy because now I only have three collision boxes inside of here. Instead of the entire mesh being applied to it. So that is how you can create custom meshes or optimize it with simple collisions in Unreal Engine 5.